I'm glad you've got the safety shirt on to do this, this work. This trip is turning into a disaster. Good morning, it's day nine of our camping adventure and we are leaving Cultus Lake and we're hitting the road. We're heading to Asoyas, it's a three hour drive and we can't wait to see what we can explore next. Making a quick stop on the side of the highway at the point of interest just to see what's happened in this area. When did it happen? In 19, no, 1965. 1965? What yeah. happened? The hope slide. The hope slide? Yeah, this number right here. That says 70 meters. We our way down the bottom. That's where the highway used to be. But the highway's no longer there. They had to move the highway up to here because the slide came down. Actually, two people that were never found are buried somewhere under there, under many, many meters of rock. It was an earthquake that started it in 1965. Are you one of those people that just drives from point A to point B, or do you stop and look along the way? Let us know in the comments. Let things cool down again, it's a good idea. Right, they're ringing just up above, past the snow gates there. Yep. There might be a pull-out section there. What do you think the problem is? I think it's uh, the rear end is overheating and it's coming out the vent, the red vent for the rear end. Hopefully that's all it is. Hopefully that's all it is. So we're just going to stop and let the van cool down a bit and hopefully that's all that the problem is. We're going to stay in our seats <laughs> while we wait for the van to cool down. But who wants a freezy? Yes, please! Yes, please! Yay! Do you want a freezy? Mm -hmm. We just keep waking you up, don't we? Awesome! You're glad the van's overheating? Can awesome! Can get a freezy? Is that what you think? It's a good thing? No, no bad thing. Well, we're on the road again. Looking for a gas station to get oil for the rear end, for the differential. going to slow it down here. It uh, sounds like the rear end's a little low on fluid there, so we're going to have to slow down and find a place to pull over. How far are we to the next community? 60 kilometers. 60 kilometers of nothing. We are at a gas station. See what they've got. So, fortunately, we found a gas station in the middle of nowhere. Okay, hopefully, they have what we need. Yeah. One bottle. That's hopefully that'll do us here. I'm glad you've got the safety shirt on to do this work. To keep me clean. You have some safety goggles and maybe a helmet too. Going. So, did you want me to tie his shoes together now or wait until he's halfway done? Oh, well, can you do it now? No. Okay, yeah. That's it. Hey, Sean. <laughs> I like how well you guys are sitting waiting while we fix the van. You guys are doing a good job. How about me? You're doing a great job. Okay, it's all fixed up. Hopefully it's that's good enough and it's good for the rest of the trip. And we're off again. We just got going and stopped at the construction. It's not really a good sign because people are all out of their vehicles up ahead, so I hope we don't have to wait too long. What do you think's happening up there? I do not know. Anybody got a guess? Maybe shuffling and making a new road. You think they're shoveling and making a new road? I know. Yes, what do you think? A rock slide. A rock slide because we just saw the rock slide? Yeah. I will be right. You think you were right? You think there was a rock slide? Yeah. Okay, let's take a look. So they're just doing some maintenance on the road. They are scaling the rocks and taking off all the loose rocks and 
putting wire fencing on to help keep it safe for everybody. And so far we're four and a half hours into our three hour drive. Trying to go up this big hill and we're smoking again. This trip is turning into a disaster. It's not sounding good. It sounds like it might be the transmission. Sean's gone to check it out. Sean and Alan are figuring out a plan for us. We're sitting on the side of the highway trying to keep safe. So what happened? I don't know. I think the trans something's gone in the transmission. That sounds expensive. It is. So the tow truck's on its way. It's going to tow the van and the trailer into the nearest community. Tina and Alan have room to take four of us. The tow truck's going to take two and then Alan will come back and get a couple more. So we are going to see if we can camp in this next community while we get the van fixed. Hopefully everything works out. Isn't you guys are lucky you got to ride in Alan's truck. There you go, the loud one. Yay! What a relief, they have a campsite here for us. So we're gonna spend the night in Princeton while we wait to see what's up with the van. Hey, Jake, stop. Alan's pulling in. There's our rescue. We can get to, we get to go back now. Yay! You have a fun day? Yeah. Uh, not that much, the van's breaking down I think time. It. I think <laughs> but it's good now. We're at the campground and we're ready to camp. Yep. Hey, Mom. Yes. Dana and me are are doing this because we want to. Us two are getting higher, and there is this watching the baby swing. Hmm. And, and he and he's never in it. That's weird. Dude. It's only for babies. Oh, well, maybe he's pretending he has a baby in there. So as you can see, the van is back with us again. Tina and Alan saved the day by rescuing us, also BCAA, and the uh, n and L um, Automotive Service here in Princeton. Uh, they stayed late to help us out. So it looks like the transmission boiled over and uh, went out the vent at the top and we lost most of our transmission fluid. So we're not really sure if that's all that the case is. We could have lost a a seal in the front of the torque converter, but we'll, we'll see soon enough. What you making, Dino? Natto. I mean, tacos. Tacos? Mm -hmm. You're cooking up the hamburger for the tacos? Mm -hmm. Very good cook. Mm -hmm. Maybe you can make all the meals. Uh, generally. Would you like to make all the meals? Yeah. What are you making? I'm making tomatoes for dinner. To knock toes. The tacos? Yep. We're making tacos? Yeah! Hey, Stino. Good. You did a good job? Mm hmm You think everyone else thinks so? Mm hmm Did he do a good job, Cheyenne? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. You think so?